Hello everybody, my name is Tiger Man, and today I'm going to look at a few things in Minimon. First off, one of I did see a minor glitch in the um, desert area as I was walking by. And there it is. Did you see that? I'll um, view it one more time. To, I'll find something one more time. I think you guys know what I mean. Okay, I hope that was... Yeah, okay, my peep. Now, I know my camera angle is a bit different this time than it was last time, and that's because... Well, to be honest... Um, I'm trying to figure out how to, I guess, record with that camera and mesh things together, so to speak. Which, I know I should have done that before I got the camera and whatnot. I just had an opportunity to get it, so I got it beforehand. So, I thought, why not? Anyway, that's a side note. Not sure what I got, but yay for me. Yay! People leveled. Now... Why, hello. Bold on. By the way, I love the new animation thing. Maybe you could add a uh, special level up music to it. Just saying, I don't know if you guys are uh, aiming towards that or not. Ooh. Nice stats. Could use a little intelligence boost, but. I'm not complaining right now. Switch. Um. Yeah, for now. See someone. Uh -huh. I don't know why, but I still find Starro to be somewhat on the weak side. I know it's first stage and yada yada, but his intelligence seems to be strong. But what can I say? Watch what. Okay, look what happens when the po. Oh gosh. When the Minimon pops from the ground. Watch that animation specifically. Is it supposed to do that? Is it supposed to be like black around and then center gray? Because honestly, I am not totally sure, but from the way the game's been, it doesn't look like it should be that way. Now. Honestly, thank you guys for taking note of my suggestions and others that may have suggested this. And I have noticed that you guys have, lack of a better term, tell me if it's the right one or not, um, imported this from, say, the, uh, from the iPhone, iOS, or whatever, that realm of gaming to PC. And I understand that simply because of the um, game's graphics. And I don't know why, but they seem kind of, the music seems kind of quiet. And it does seem, and I, the reason why I bring up the graphics is because that's usually a big part of I guess you could say the atmosphere of what the game is. You know what I mean? Like, okay, look at if you look at Borderlands 2, it has a car cartoony graphics or comic book style graphics, which I'm sure a fair amount of people love about it. I'm not saying it it needs this game needs that, but polish around the minimon. Like, like if you look at Met. Uh, Metaron and his 3D um, thing, you're not supposed to tell that it's a, uh, not, you guys are using like polygons, you're supposed to, it's supposed to look like a circle. Just as a reference, not saying you guys need to do this, but if you look at Pokemon, look at the Pokemon Magnemite and Diglett and whatnot. They are polished, but they look you know, round, spherical, and all that good stuff. Not 
how Metron looks like. You can tell polygons from use triangles, blah, blah, blah. I think you get my point. I'm not saying you need to do that soon. I'm not saying that's going to stop me from playing, which obviously it hasn't. I'm just saying before final release, either before final release and now, try and polish everything out. Does that? Am I making sense? I hope I am. Please, please, developers, let me know if I'm making sense in anything I say. I mean, how am I supposed to know I'm making sense if you guys don't give me some kind of feedback on what I say? Um, now, there is the issue of some silver coins. What the... I wouldn't say they're issues, but I would say they're kind of curious. Uh, watch right here. I am kind of curious what those silver coins will be used for for the next um, for the game. What's this? Who are you again? Oh, that's right. That's right. Um. 11,008, okay. Farm deed, move to ranch, yes. Now, I did receive the note about why you guys have different, what the, oh. Why you guys have different ranches, and I guess I accept that, but at the same time, please add a couple of notes saying, what's this? Did I just not explore this that much? Okay, what? Okay, according to the minimap, this isn't all that there is. Did you, I was wondering if you guys could explain that. Did you guys increase the size of this? Oh, and why do you have it set at 50 minimon? I'm not, look, I'm, I'm really not complaining, but seriously, I'm not trying to complain at all whenever I talk about this game, but you guys want my opinion, so, oh, watch this. Again, I don't know if you guys want this in or not, but if you guys want this to be, look, Two glitches here. My guy character's walking backwards, and I just walked through a fence. Seriously? Look, I don't know how common this glitch is where my character walks backwards, but look into it, please, and make sure it's fixed, because it's kind of on the annoying side, if you ask me. And I'm walking through a fence again. Yay! No, I'm going to... If I can just... Please tell me where I can find a cave, because this is getting kind of stupid. I'm, I want to show you guys what the battle looks like in there, but for some reason I can't ever remember where the cave is. And why am I asked if I want to go up or not? Of course I do. I mean, is there like a... I don't know. What's this? Something right here? No? What's supposed to... Why is there a fence there? I mean, normally I would think that there's something like secretive right where that, between that fence is. Um, maybe another graphical glitch right, right here. I don't know. Something to look at. Let's see. Where are you? Tired place rest. Whoa. Um, quick question. How come? One thing to think about, actually two things, is look at this guy. Master Ivy. Now you can get to the Ladder of Sheba. Maybe you can have it to where, I don't know, like whenever you go to Master Ivy. I'm crazy, Adam. Like if you visit his place again, maybe you can go and say... 
have him say, uh, what's over here? The frick? This guy drunk? <laughs> oh, finally finished. Wow, dude. Um, you're fairly creepy and disturbingly creepy. Anyway, <laughs> look into that, guys, because I don't know what to think of him. Anyway, like, okay, look right here. I can go back to talk to him anytime I want to, right? If that's true, then I should... Shouldn't he have something to say to me, like... Um, oh, not leveled up or not have enough friends? Maybe you should go back to such and such. What the frick frack was that? Um, anyways. If you do, if you include something like that, I think that would be good. Um. Okay, my, car my guy just glitched out for a second. I still don't know what the point of the whole, okay, be careful with the ladder. I mean, it doesn't, is there a point? Like, is it part of the storyline that I'm not missing? Or that I am missing? Or what? Oh, for little black spots right here where my character is to go to the next session. Section. Shut up, you guys know what I mean. Maybe you should include maybe a little bit of texture, not, maybe a little bit of coloring, not black. I know it's a nitpick thing, but come on, guys. Okay, I know I know for a fact you guys saw my my mini mon glitch there. And let's see. Gonna be cut some arrow. Okay, hold on, let me show you guys something. Right now the USA servers are offline, so I can't show you a glitch that I saw there. Um But there is a friends list glitch. What's this? Metal 2 of Chroma? What? What? Where is that? No! What's this? Okay, well, apparently I entered this cave and I don't know how to get out. If any of you guys know, please let me know. Um, because I'm kind of stuck there. If that's not supposed to be an accessible place, and why is it accessible? Anyway. I'll have to end the episode right here. I'm sorry, guys. But, anyway... I will see you all in the next episode. Bye-bye!